Hi, I'm Nat, and I'm a junior from Marion. This poem is called Shakespeare Himself. Shakespeare himself. Do not tell me, for I've heard it all. And there is much to do with hate, but much more to do with love. I was always taught that parents love their children unconditionally. They could never hate something they created. She'd never admit it, but part of my mother has to hate me. And I think I've cried over school more times than I did when I found out my granddad had a heart attack. And the words, you are not a failure, become an 86. Is that even a B? My granddad smokes cigarettes on his sun porch and tells me that school is wrong. I believe him. And when I came to his house and cried on his beloved couch and told him that I failed, he patted my head and got ash in my hair. Three weeks later, I ran home to his house on 53rd Street and I threw open the door and I said, Granddad, I didn't fail this time. And he said, it doesn't matter if you did anyway. Shakespeare is something I pride myself on. And in my life, I have a bounty of villains, and none of them quite compare to Richard III and his hunchback, but they happen to be simple things, like the slouch that I'll never get rid of due to my heavy backpack, and my problems with trust because my textbooks are full of lies. Shakespeare just so happens to be one of the three things that I am good at, besides self-victimization and being unpleasant. <laughs> I'm not an outstanding student, and I'm not a spectacular dancer, but Shakespeare is my greatest strength, usually. But I got a D on my Othello test, and I got yelled at in the parking lot of a McDonald's, and I cried because I got yelled at, and I got yelled at because I cried. And I felt so bad for the man that walked in front of my car and saw me. How? How could you have gotten a 72? I don't know. And I love Shakespeare. I love the murder. I love the conspiracy. Maybe I failed Othello because I wasn't focused on revenge. And maybe I did so well on my Julius Caesar test because I'm used to getting stabbed in the back by people I love.